solve y n plus two minus four y n is equal to zero. Now the given equation is this. We are going to solve this using z transform and inverse z transform. Now I am going to take z transform on both sides of this equation. I'll be getting on further simplification. Now I am going to substitute formulas for z y n plus two and z y n. Now I don't know y naught and y one, so I assume. Y and Y naught is equal to A and Y one is equal to B, and I am going to substitute the values, and I am going to combine Y of Z terms together. I'll be getting Z square minus four. Then I'll be getting minus A Z square minus B Z is equal to zero. So now my Y of Z Is equal to. I'm bringing all the terms together. A is it minus B is it by is it square minus four four. So I can rewrite my y of z is equal to A is it square by is it square minus four B is it by is it square minus four. Now we are going to simplify this. Is it square by is it minus two into is it plus two? Multiply and divide by two. Then add plus two is it and subtract two is it. Now write rewrite this as plus is it square. So this is it two is it square is split splitted as one is it square and one is it square. And again, here you will be having z two into z minus two into z plus two. Now combine these two terms together and these two terms together. So I can take z into z plus two plus z into minus two plus z that is z minus two by two into z minus two into z plus two. Now I am going to split this. So I'll be getting z into z plus two by two into z minus two into z plus two. Again, plus this term z into this I can rewrite as z minus two by two into z minus two into z plus two. So here this will get cancelled. Here this will get cancelled, and I'll be getting z by Two into z minus two plus z by two into z plus two. So this is equal to this. In the same way, we are going to simplify this. Now multiply and divide by four. Then add plus z square minus z square. So this two is four is it can be written as is it square plus two is it plus two is it minus is it square by four into is it plus two into is it minus two. So now I am going to combine these two terms together and these two terms together. So when I take commonly, I'll be getting is it into is it plus two. Here I am taking minus is it outside. So I'll be getting z minus two by four into z plus two into z minus two. So now when I split the terms, z by z plus two divided by four into z plus two into z minus two minus z into z minus two. By four into z plus two into z minus two. Now we have found that z square by z minus two into z plus two is this. Z by z minus two into z plus two is this. Now my y of z is equal to a z square minus b z by z minus two into z plus two. So this I can write as a z square by 
z minus 2 into z plus 2 plus b z by z minus 2 into z plus 2. So now for this z square by this I am going to substitute this. For this z by this I am going to substitute this. So this is equal to a by 2 into this z by z minus 2 plus z by z plus 2. b by 4 into z by z minus 2 minus z by z plus 2. So now I am going to combine z by z minus 2 terms together and z by z plus 2 terms together. So now I will be getting z by z minus 2 into a by 2 plus b by 4. Then when, when I combine z by z plus 2 terms together, I will be getting a by 2 minus b by 4. Apply inverse z transform. So now I will be getting z inverse of y of z is equal to a by 2 plus b by 4 into z inverse of z inverse of z by z minus 2 plus a by 2 minus b by 4 into z inverse of z by z plus 2. So now when I apply the formula, I will be getting a by 2 plus b by 4 into 2 power n plus a by 2 minus b by 4 into minus 2 to the power n, minus of minus 2, minus 2 to the power n. Now consider sum x is equal to a by 2 plus b by 4 and y is equal to a by 2 minus b by 4. Then z inverse of y of z is y of n is equal to x to power n plus y into minus 2 the whole power yeah